I'm fishing the Alignac River in Alaska. I've traveled over 20,000 kilometers to get here, 20 more steps, and I'm gonna catch some absolute crackers. Morning team, let's catch some fish. After an epic boat ride, we'd have to stop many times to look at the bears you did at the big jobs, yet we have arrived at the fishing destination. What are we fishing for and how are we going to catch them? We're fishing for Arctic char and I'm pretty sure we're using a bead under a float. Sounds like a plan. Alright boys, let's hit the water. So Jacob, what's the plan? Are we casting towards the bank? Uh, yeah, right as this creek feeds in and you want to be casting right over there. Said hit. Got him. <laughs> yeah, you do. Yeah. <laughs> that was just beautiful. First cast. We might have to call this first cast hole. Ooh, nice. That's a good All fish. Alright, try Jack. and get that line back on the reel. Oh, he's taking line. That's a good fish. Oh. Nice. That's it, Jet. Good boy. Look at that. That is a beautiful char. And this is just ridiculous. I remember coming here years ago and it was just like every cast and it hasn't seemed to have changed a lot. No, it hasn't, no. That's just crazy. And when that float gets to the top, you have to stop. That's so that's perfect. Beautiful fish. Hey! Nice! Beautiful! Now, Jet, in future, I'd like you not to take so long to catch a fish. <laughs> Look at that. This is one of the prettiest fish in the river. Look at that beautiful fish. I'm going to ask the tough question. Please explain. Is it an Arctic char or a Dolly Varden? It's a Dolly Charden. What do you think, Jet? <laughs> well, I think it's a Dolly Varden. I think for me, char are more bright and a bit more. It's a very contentious issue in these parts, so well, please this... don't send emails. <laughs> okay. <yeah. laughs> and there goes a beautiful fish. How sweet is he? He's just gonna sit right behind my boot, I reckon. Yep. Yeah. Because <laughs> that's a safe place for him. There, that's there a fish. Is. Nice, nice. Well done, keep mate. Keep him tight, that's a nice one. Good work. Just keep, keep him tight, strip, 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 strip. Don't strip. worry about whining, just strip. And it's a tough thing with fly fishing. Let him go if he needs to, just loose on your finger. And now you should be, oh, now strip, strip, strip. Just keep, keep him tight, keep him tight, keep him, tight, just, keep him top. Just fight, that's it, you, that's all you can do, mate. Just keep that rod bent. There you go. Let him take line if he needs yeah, to. Yeah, loose on your finger yep, and, just, yeah, just, right now you should be reeling. Now you can reel, yep. But let him go if he needs to. Good. It's really, really tough fly fishing. You see here, Jet's got all this line. That's what he's using to cast. And what he's doing is holding the fish and fighting it with his fingers. And now he's picked up the line and can actually fight the fish on the reel. It's pretty hard for people to get used to, isn't it, at times? Well, there's a lot to remember, yeah. You think it's fair to say fly fishing is all about line management? Uh, it definitely is, definitely is. You know the other thing I love about fly fishing? They have fancy terms for things. On that rig, we've got what I'd call a float. If you're a fly fisherman, it's called a? Indicator. An indicator. It ain't a float. <laughs> That's a really good fish, Jet. Thank you. And that big rod is acting like a big bit of spaghetti just stopping that line from going ping. Got his head up. Perfect. Hey. Nice. Hey. Well done, Thank mate. You. That is awesome. It's a nice fish. So why is it you love the char, mate? Oh, their looks, how they fight and how they thrive. There's so many of them. They are here in big numbers. I wet my hands. He's still going. Look at this beautiful, beautiful fish. And he might have had a running with a bear or something. Look at his tail. He's actually had a bit of a nip there. Would that be a bear perhaps, mate? Uh, well, he's a resident fish, so he's been up here for a long time. That could be even something in the ocean. Oh, there you go. What a magnificent fish. Look at those colours, whoops. It's your Uncle Arthur, isn't it? Nice and slippery. Magnificent fish. So not actually a member of the trout family? Uh, no, the char are uh, part of their own uh, family. There you yeah. go. The family they come from is a very pretty one, though. Well, Jetty, magnificent fish. I'll do the honours for you. Look at that guy there, he's going to go very quick. Oh. That is gold. So just over there, we were catching some beautiful Arctic char. Chris, you were sitting in the boat taking photos and you noticed some big red submarines over here. What do you reckon they are? <laughs> they could only be one thing in this part of the world and that's a big king salmon. Well, we've got the man who knows how to catch them, so let's go do it.
So we've got some king salmon sitting here. I can literally see them. And they're holding up in these pools. Are they Jacob ready to move up the river? Yeah, they, they like the deeper holes uh, they stage before moving up to spawn. Big fish, get the line, get the line. Go, give, him, give him some, give him some. You've got to get him around. You've got to... Holy snapping duck job, he's Christy. Oh, yeah. Now, listen to Jacob. I think you want to get the rod tip back this way. Hang up. Yeah, I want to get it into the slower yeah, water. Yeah, go this way. Rod tip, rod tip this way. This is a big fish. That's it. You want to try and pull the fish around this way. Rod tip low and towards the downstream shore. Anytime he gives you anything, you need to take it for, from him. Okay. So we're fishing 20 pound test. Yep. He's probably a little bigger than 20 pounds, but uh, we want to try and turn his head down river and into this slack water whenever he gives you anything. Okay. This is a king or Chinook salmon, and uh, these fish grow to almost 100 pounds. In fact, I think the world record's at 94 pounds. He's actually got a mate sitting in there with him, Whoa. and uh, this is an absolute brute. That's it, that's it. Keep coming, keep coming, keep the rod tip far left. That's what you want to do. That's good, that's good, that's good, Dar. That's it, that's it, go. It's his turn, his turn, that's it. Keep coming, keep coming, keep, that's it, good. He's coming, he's coming. You're doing well, Darl. He's still, he's still got his head and that's a big fish. Oh! oh. Let oh. him go, let him go. That's a nice. big fish, well done. Oh, one, 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 one. That's one. it. And back up that way, back up that way. Turn it back all the way, back that all way, the way. Which way, which way, which way? That, that, way, that, that way, way, that way, that way. Good, good, good. That's good, that's good. Oh God, oh God. That's a big real, fish. Real, 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 real. Just remember to let go. Let, yeah, let go you when he wants to take it. Keep that rod up a bit. But he's coming towards you now. Back this way. You're good, you're good. Now lift slowly, transition high. Reel a little bit more. Good, now let, take your hand off the reel. Try and lift his head up out of the water. He's not gonna like it, he might go. Keep him coming this way. Reel down. Okay, now stop. Now try and lift his head high and out of the water for me. Oh. That's fine, that's fine. Let him go, let take him go. Your time. Take your time. <laughs> And the same thing this way, same thing this way. Lift his, Lift head. his head up out of the water and turn him down this way. Yes! Nice! nice. Come on, on, girl. Jacob. That is a Thank cracker. You. Well done, look at that. Okay, okay. That is why they Let call them the king. Jump in, darling. What a stellar effort. Oh my gosh, look at that colour of look this thing. Look at that for a fish. I know I keep saying that, but these things just turn the most incredible colours. Oh my goodness me, what a fish. That is Thank just Thank you so much. Epic. That is what that is just what dreams are made of right there. That it is certainly beautiful is. Beautiful fish. Big king salmon. We can see him in the river literally over here catching char. Turn around, cast. Is that your biggest salmon you ever caught, Christy? Yeah, 100%. This no guy's fault. probably about 20, 23 pounds. <laughs> yep. That is. And will he get even redder as he goes up? Uh, he'll get redder as he gets ready to spawn. He's probably about a week and a half away from spawning right now, yeah. Paul, that is one of the most memorable days fishing I have ever, ever had. Thank you to ATA Lodge. I will never forget this fish and this moment. We're I'm, ready to I'm let it go. go. <laughs> when you are ready, darling, that is just one of the most beautiful things I've ever seen. Thank but you. There's only one thing I can do. And that is salute that fish. <laughs> that is awesome! <laughs> Love your work. <laughs>